Hello, beautiful. I'm so glad to see you here today. I am so excited because I turned 30 and it's so exciting to me how I feel so differently about getting older and I wanted to talk about that today because I feel like this is a new chapter in my life turning 30 shutting the door on my 20s and opening up to a new decade where I'm more confident and I know myself better and I think it's going to be a fantastic time of my life. I'm really excited. I want to talk about how there was a time where I really wasn't excited by this stuff and my mom was talking to me about how she's so proud of me because I'm happy to turn 30. And I used to be so freaked out about getting old and I've been using anti-aging creams since I was in my early, early 20s. And I sporadically used them when I was in my teens, but I didn't start regularly using them until my 20s. And I have just always been in entertainment and I know that we were always told uh, how women have a shelf life for work. And now I just kind of feel like, no, fuck you. I can do YouTube and I can make content that I want to make. And I can shut the door on my relationship with mass media and the entertainment industry that is of the past and open the door to this new entertainment industry that is more about authenticity and fun and being creative and being yourself and being off like being authentically yourself is the coolest thing ever and when i was in that world i never felt like i could be myself there was very few people that I felt that way with. And I'm so glad now that I'm in this new chapter. And the time when I really had the biggest issue with my age was actually when I turned 18. When I turned 18, I had a nervous breakdown. And I mean like an actual nervous breakdown because I had never thought that I would live to be 18, I never imagined that I would be an adult. I always thought I would die as a teenager and I technically did and then came back, but like I didn't die and stay dead. And I am, it, it was just a, it was a really, difficult time and I had this nervous breakdown because I didn't plan for my life. I always thought that I would die and I didn't know what I wanted to do. So then I started soul searching after being depressed for a very good while and figuring out what I really wanted to do with my life. Where where did my heart live and and breathe? And for me music was what I felt I wanted to do at the time and um, uh, and then I started dabbling doing film uh, doing indie film and uh, for doing sound for indie film and makeup for indie film and doing all of these really interesting things in the music industry music videos um, I think the first real production that I was a part of was actually doing makeup on a music video, now that I think of it. And I never imagined that I would be able to have opportunities like that. I, when I turned 18, I just, I had no clue what I wanted to do with my life. And I really had this breakdown that was really challenging and I thought uh, that that might happen when I turned 30 and I think my family thought that that might happen as well but I, I am genuinely happy 
to have survived to be 30. I'm so grateful to be alive. And I really want to start this new chapter by getting better about doing YouTube. So what I want to do is make a bunch of videos regularly a few times a week uh, that are less quality videos and then have higher quality videos that I wanted to put a little bit more production value into that won't be released on a regular basis but will just be released whenever they're done. <laughs> But I want to start uploading more regularly, and I want to do high quality content, but I also want to put out more content. So I think that that would be a happy medium by having some more quick content like this that's just filmed and then quickly edited with little special effects and everything and just put out there a little more raw. <laughs> um, and that's, yes, I'm at six minutes, so it will be a short video. But I'm so excited to turn 30. I'm redoing things in my room, which these are new curtains. And I, I put up these new lights, which if I turn this down, you can probably see it better. Like how pretty are those lights? I'm so psyched for those lights. You don't even know. And I have them going around half of my room and I plan on getting more and I'm getting some plants that are in the mail. But uh, basically, I was asked, what do I want for my birthday? And I basically wanted to redo my room and, and uh, do some redecorating. And I think the lights, I think it's just so cool. My mom actually stenciled these onto the wall. She has this whole nature theme in my room. And she stenciled this on the wall when I was gosh, I think I was 12 or 11 or something like that. And I was away at camp and she surprised me with a new bedroom makeover and they had all that. And I was just so excited. And uh, basically coming back here, I wanted to, uh, let me turn the light back up. Oh, you trying to brighten up my under eye circles a little bit. I'm just so tired. <laughs> It's like four in the morning right now. But um, but yeah, I got some new curtains and they're easier to open so that way I can have more light in here during the day so I can maybe even film in here without studio lighting during the day. Uh, so I'm just really excited for um, this new chapter of my life and kind of letting go of old uh, things in my room, old people in my life and bringing, allowing room for new things to grow and starting this new endeavor. And that's my intention for this next chapter of my life is really putting my health first. So that way everything else in my life can fall in line. And I'm finally getting control of my health, which makes me feel like I can actually put out videos regularly. So. Let's hope I actually do it this time because I keep wanting to do it and then I will get sick and then I get sick and then I'm just too tired and then I have one good day and then I want to enjoy that day and not work because I've felt like shit for a month and I'm finally starting to get my medication like figured out and my vitamin levels figured out and all of that and trying different alternative therapies which I will be sharing with you about my journey and just what I'm thinking and feeling that day. So I'm excited and I hope that you join this family that I want to build of healing and I want to gather people that are interested in also growing and healing from the things in their life, whether it's severe trauma, uh, rape, uh, attempted murder, torture, or down to just if you want to cope better with daily stress in the workplace. I really want this channel to be a place where people can come and share in that. And, and build that family. So if you want to be a part of that, please subscribe for that. And if you are excited to see what's up to come, please like this video. I hope that you are having a beautiful, beautiful day. Please let me know how your day is going in the comments below. Say hi, tell me about yourself, and I send you so much love. 
anybody that's watching this, I send you so much love and I look forward to seeing you soon.